You have to pray for your nation. You know, there is a saying that all it takes for evil to prosper is for those who know good and will not do it. It's not going to take easy, lazy kind of prayer to rescue a nation from the grips of forces of darkness. It took force. And I mean spiritual force to bring Israel out of Egypt. If all is well with your nation, those of you who are here, no sickness, no problems, no famine, no hardship. If all is well with your nation, then please just join me in praying for my own nation. And we're going to cry to God that all these sufferings must end. It takes more than any man, no matter how well intentioned, to solve the problems of a nation. No matter how good our president may be, no matter how well-intentioned, there are forces of darkness beyond the ability of any man. It took only four years to build the expressway. Four years. Including the long bridge over Mashigram. It took more than seven years to repair. It took a while before it occurred to me. Hey, wait a minute. This is not an ordinary situation. There are certain forces that realized that if traffic is flowing freely here, then people will be able to come to programs here. That's when I took the matter to the Lord in prayer. I thank God he answered my prayer. To get Israel out of bondage, some people had to die. Some people had to drown. Some people had to be uprooted. 